Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I have combined all the important questions for chemistry for 2023 boards. We have got these chapters like HCl, HNO3, NH3, H2SO4 and the organic chemistry part in which named reactions can be asked. So whenever you write any reaction, uh, I'll take an example like the Havers process. We have uh, N2 plus H2 with this sign which gives 2 NH3 we have to balance it accordingly right and then uh, place the temperature the catalyst the product and also um, whenever there is a test asked you have to write that test in order to identify this gas so you may say for ammonia you can combine it with HCl gas uh, and it forms NH4Cl that is uh, white ammonium chloride fumes to gain full marks in reaction part, you have to include temperature, pressure, catalyst, product and also balance it. Balancing is the most important part, right? If you don't know how to balance or you want short tricks on how to uh, balance, then you can uh, search a video on YouTube and it, it is by Physicswala. I also referred from that. You may go and check it out. Now we have equation for esterification dehydrohalogenation, dehydration, halogenation that are very important. Now I'll introduce you to this uh, physics and chemistry ebook. Physics has most important question bank and as you can see the price is less and uh, the questions are here. The most important questions are likely to come in the board examination and there is this chemistry full syllabus reactions. You can have a look. The original cost is um, not as the cost which is present now. You can buy it from the, in the description box or I will pin it in the comment section. Practice naming of organic compounds and their drawing. Uh, you can uh, practice IUPAC naming and also the nomenclature. They are short, uh, short, short questions. The property of sulfuric acid like a uh, property as a dibasic acid as an oxidizing agent and so on the balancing part is a little bit difficult there so you have to practice it electron dot structure are very very important they may ask you for hydronium ion or nh4 plus please practice the ionic and covalent bonding also then some equations and observation during electrolysis are asked especially of uh, lead bromide that is pbvr2 and copper sulfate you have to write the reaction and then add cathode add anode and also the electro refining of copper analytical chemistry where observations and equations are very important they may uh, ask you the color the precipitate Aluminum is extraction and refining in metallurgy and composition of various alloys. Look at the syllabus and study it well. Reaction of HCl with oxidizing agents with silver nitrate, ammonia and uh, what does it form? Like AgCl is a white precipitate. Uh, reaction of NH3 with excess chlorine and reverse case. Why NO3 is yellow? and not stored in glass bottle reaction of concentrated and dilute HNO3 with copper why is it uh, stored in aluminium and iron bottle reasoning questions are always asked right action of H2SO4 with a carbohydrate distinguish between barium sulfate and sulfide the formation of soluble insoluble salts then we have general action of acids now uh, a question that is definitely asked from the periodic table which is about atomic size ionization potential electron uh, affinity electronegativity they may ask you to arrange the elements in increasing order of ionization potential or decreasing order of electron affinity study all the chemical combinations by heart keeping in mind the compounds uh, forming covalent bonds and the nature of the bond then we have uh, from acids, bases and salts, the various um, methods of preparation of these salts. And please keep in mind the methods used for the preparation. All equations must be learned by heart for analytical chemistry, even when excess is poured. This case is very important not to be neglected. The color and nature of precipitates, 
and whether uh, they dissolve in excess. For electrolysis, a uh, product formed at the cathode and anode, as I've told you earlier, the observation of anode and cathode and the color of the solution. Naming reactions like Oswald process, then Haber's process, then esterification, and so on. Contact process, yes. I would end this video now. Uh, thank you for watching this. Have a good day and all the best for your exams.